Hi everybody, we are gonna do this lotus flower. So I'm gonna take my medium brush and I'm gonna paint in the background first. I'm gonna start with my green. And so I'm gonna grab that green and I'm gonna paint around the flower. So I'm just gonna move this here. And I don't even need any water when I do this. I'm just kind of moving it back and forth. If you need a smaller brush to get in these lines, you can use a smaller brush for that. I'm gonna take a little bit of black, and just a little bit, because I wanna blend it onto this canvas. And I'm gonna grab the black and go up in the corner. I'm just moving it back and forth to get that texture. I'm not going all the way down, I'm just doing a little bit up at the top. I'm not gonna wash my brush. I'm gonna grab some more green. And I'm gonna, this time I'm gonna go back and forth instead of making the X, I'm gonna dip it in water. And I can grab a little bit more black because I wanna make it dark. I dip in a little bit too much water, but I'm just gonna go in. Back and forth in this background to give it some more texture. If there's an area where it's too white or you don't like it, you can always go back in with more green. And add a little bit of water, and I'm going to go back into this lake. And later on, I'll go back in and make the final touches when it dries. But I'm just kind of taking a little bit of blue. I'm going to even add a little bit of blue and white in there to make a light blue. I'm going away. And I'm going to outline my petals in red. And I'm going to do, so I outlined it in red. And then I'm just going to paint just maybe like a finger on the very top red. red and white and I'm just using a little bit of the red and I'm going to paint the bottom of this so I'm going to start from the bottom and kind of move my way up Okay, so now I'm going to go into the, with a small brush, I'm going to go into the lotus again. And I'm going to take my yellow, and I'm just going to kind of dab in the middle with a yellow. So that's the center of it. I'm not going to wash my brush. I'm actually going to grab some white. And I have just like this tiniest bit of yellow. And I'm going to grab a little bit of red. It's going to make some yellow, red, and white. And I'm going to go in the bottom, and I'm going up. I'm going like halfway up. Then I'm going to go and grab just some more white. And I'm going to start from the bottom and just add a little bit more white to the bottom. So mixing red white and just a tinge of yellow, like a little bit of the yellow. I'm going again, so I'm gonna go in this one. So I'm going halfway through. And then I'm gonna add more white to the very bottom. And if the white isn't showing up, you can make that color, that white, yellow, red color a little bit darker. So I'm gonna 
do it for each petal. So I've got the red, white, and a tinge of yellow. Going halfway up, and then I'm going to put white on the bottom. Okay, so now I'm going to go back in and I'm going to clean my brush. I'm going to take my red and I'm going to do this all over again. So I'm going to start from the top. Outline the petal. And then I'm just going to drag some of the top down just a little bit. And I can even take my finger a little bit to blend it or I can just take nothing on my brush and just grab a little bit of that with a little bit of water and bring it that right down so it has a blend. So I'm going to work on one petal at a time. I can go back in and also add a little bit more white to it too to make it lighter. Okay, so now I'm going to go back into the yellow with the red. I'm just taking my small brush and I'm going to outline just a little bit of that centerpiece and kind of make a few lines going down. And I'll go back into this later with my small. Actually, I'm going to clean it. I'm going to take a little bit of white and a little bit of yellow. And I'm going to go back in and make some more lines. So. It's not so perfect. I'm gonna grab my blue. This is dry now, so I'm gonna go in it with some blues, and I'm gonna mix a little bit of blue and white together. And I'm gonna go in this flake. And I can actually be thicker if I want this. I'm just going back and forth and making these dashes to get me some, get some different tones in here. And I'm going to leave like three fingers below because I'm going to add some more greens in there. So I'm going to take my green. I didn't even have to wash my brush. And I'm just going to mix a little bit of green and yellow. Make it a little lighter. I'm just kind of Go across so it looks. So I'm mixing a little bit of green and white this time to make it a little lighter. I'm just going to go across just a tinge. I'm going to mix a little bit of blue and white. I'm going to go up here so it just has a nice light blue around that flower. And then I'm going to go on the bottom with some more greens. I'm mixing that green with just a little bit of white so I get some more colors in here. I'm going to go in with a little bit more blue just to get a little brighter on this, some of these areas. Okay, so I'm going to clean my brush. Actually, I'm going to grab one more area of blue and just kind of 
put a little bit more blue in. Then I'm gonna clean my brush. And I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna make red and white, which is pink. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just kind of do it just a little bit of dashes to make it like the reflection is coming off on the lake. I'm doing it very, very, very lightly. So just kind of just a few little dashes in here. And I'll fill in some of this bottom part with some blue too. Again, just some dashes where it kind of And then I can do a few more longer, almost longer strokes. I take my black and I'm just gonna do a little bit of black underneath that flower. I'm giving it a shadow, so I'm just gonna grab that black, bring it out just a tinge. I'm just kind of drag oops, I'm gonna kind of drag it just a little. Okay. And then I'm going to add just a tinge of black on the side over here. Okay, the last thing I need to do, and it just cleaning it up, now that it's dry, I can go back in a little bit in the bottom and do a little bit more white on my bottom to just get it to really pop. And you don't have to do it in all these sections, but just going back in just with a little bit of white and bring it out. Then I can take a little bit of that red and I mix it with just a tinge of blue to get like a darker red and I can go in and just real lightly outline the petals one last time. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for tuning in.